Good morning. This is Bishop Turner. I want to take the time to pray with you. This is uh, Sunday the 22, uh, and this is uh, the last uh, year of the month, and we're going to pray for you today. I want to share something with you, and very briefly, I want to pray for you. And I, what I got here is the Holy Bible. I want to put it up before that because I want to let you know that the Bible is the only thing that we got to fight the crime and the evil. And I want to give you the word. As I hold this book up, to, I'm just, the, Spirit just, the Spirit told me to just hold the Bible up and let you see where it's a holy Bible. The Ten Commandments in there. God healing is in this book. In this book, love in this book, joy in this book. And the Spirit told me to hold this book up. And if you touch your computer as I hold this book up, you're going to receive a healing and deliverance right now. Father God, the God of Abraham, the God of Jacob, Father God, we come right now. We rebuke every evil spirit. Father God, we come right now. Touch, heal, and deliver. Somebody need a healing this morning. Somebody need a special delivery this morning. As I hold this word up, the word of God is speaking to cancer. It's speaking to high blood. It's speaking to cataracts. It's speaking to confused minds. It's speaking to people that have lost their way. Right now, Jesus is the reason for the season. In this December month of 2013, going into 2014, this is the book you need to read. This is the book you need to follow. The Ten Commandments in him. God loves in him. For God so loved the world, he gave his own begotten son, that whoever believes in him shall not perish. And I want to tell you, this is here for you. Oh, God bless right now. On this Sunday morning, I know you got some problems, but I'm praying for you. I'm praying for you, Sister Raw. I'm praying for you, Dr. Cook. I'm praying for you, Bobby. Right now, I want to let you know that God can do anything but fail. There's no fail. I'm praying for all the families in Berea. Dark energy. The, the dark energy have caught them up. And I want to say the Holy Bible is the only way. In 2014, in 2013, in 2015, the Holy Book. And I want you to look at this and look at it and say, I'm healed. I'm healed. I'm healed. I'm delivered in the name of Jesus. I'm praying for you, Sister Scott. I'm praying for you, Sister Gibson. I'm praying for you, uh, Sister Nixon. I'm praying for you, Sister Love. I'm praying for you that asked me to pray. There's no sorrow on earth that heaven cannot heal. Every family that's going through a lonely period, going through a drought period, as I hold this Bible up, your business is going to be blessed. As I hold this Bible up, you're going to have more customers. Your sales going to go up. Your business is going to work. Your home coming through. Your son getting out of jail. Your daughter coming off the prostitution rope. In the name of Jesus, right now, I just felt this morning, I just should hold the word up. Let the word speak to you. I ain't gonna, I want the Holy Bible, and I want you to meditate on it, and I want you to meditate on it this morning. I want you to look in yourself. Clean yourself up. I want you to look into your mind and clean your mind up from every negative energy, from every dark energy. I want to say this here, all is well in your life today. All is well in December, January, February. I'm going into a new year knowing that God going to bless you. I'm going into the new year praying for you, Tracy, praying for you, and praying for you, you, and you. It's so many names. Uh, Dr. Christian, I'm praying for you. Uh, Vanjie Russell, I'm praying for you. Uh, Professor Linda, I'm praying for you. Uh, Pastor Colin, I'm praying for you. Dr. Colin, I'm praying for you. Dr. Cook, I'm praying for you. Dr. Turner, I'm praying for you. And I'm praying for you and you. I want to let you know, this is your breakthrough season. This is your season for success. This is your season for growth. This is your season to be blessed because you, you know, for God, he's, he's alpha and omega, the beginning and the end. And the Spirit told me, I was getting ready to preach, to know somebody needs to find them, lift the word up. 
I want you to go to this Bible 